conversations. So today we are talking about video and specifically how to get a high quality video. Um, this is something that we got a request for and we love requests. And so if you have some, we'd, we'd love to do it. But um, we're talking less about content today, but just how to set your video up. Uh, so the first thing you want to pay attention to, and you probably know this because we've been all doing Zoom calls nonstop um, since March 2020, pay attention to your camera angle. So you can see the way things are set up behind me and Nicole, oh, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we all sounds obvious, but I get on so many Zoom calls and I'm like, uh, you know, where are you? <laughs> so thank you for that visual, Nicole. Uh, make sure you are centered. Pay attention to what's behind you. We're going to talk a little bit more about that. Um, people are going to be looking at you, whether you think they are or, or not. So just, yeah, first mm -hmm. things first, camera angle. Number two, use an external microphone. Um, this is something, I don't know, I got off of Amazon for 10 bucks because as my father-in-law says, I am a low talker. Um, and sometimes you kind of ramble and you don't, you don't remember you need to project. And so this just, um, you can place this in front of you because otherwise like you're trying to be here and be on the phone, or, you know, the microphone, it doesn't work. So um, having a, an external microphone can just help improve the quality. Yeah, I'm, I'm very loud. I don't use an external microphone. <laughs> People can probably hear me outside. Yeah. All right. So I already talked about backgrounds a little bit. So tip number three, really be mindful of the background and how your camera is focusing on you versus your background. Sometimes your camera, like especially if you're on your phone, will get confused and it'll start focusing on like maybe a painting or a sculpture behind you instead of your face and you end up looking fuzzy and and weird and you don't realize it until you watch the video you have to go back and record the whole thing all over again and colors make a difference too like there's this mm -hmm. thing called white balance um meaning like the the camera's going to focus on the the brightest thing and i was i was trying to edit something from one of my clients the other day and she was all out of focus because the camera was focused on the bright closet white closet door behind her right and so it, it's kind of maybe um if you're going to do regular videos sometimes maybe do like a quick stamp like a five second sample first see how it comes out and then go forward yeah yeah no that's a, that's a good tip just test real quick test. Mm -hmm. which comes right back into um your settings and your setups test your light um a lot of people tend to think oh i'm going to sit with the window behind me because that's going to give me light but what it does is put you in shadow you wanna make sure you're facing the light. So um, face the window, come at you instead of behind you. Yeah, absolutely. Tape, um, tape videos on your phone, make sure you're using the horizontal format, not the landscape format. Because it's natural for us to go like this, right? Which is there, but then you get this cutoff video and a lot of black space around. And so if you hold it, this might feel less natural, um, but it'll show up a little bit better. Excellent. So thanks for joining us. Um, we will be back with more tips, of course, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.